Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. Today we are moving the spring decorating out into the living room. We have tackled the kitchen and the bedroom and it is time to get this area all spruced up for springtime. Um, I am going to be, ma my main focus today is to get the built-ins done um, and just a couple little areas around the living room, but this area right here is the main focus of this room and in the kitchen. It is our chimney that goes up to 24 feet, I believe. So it has the center of attention, no matter where or what entrance that you enter this house from, that's what you see. So I really want this to just really pizzazz um, and give that spring kind of cottage feel to it. We do live in a cottage out in the country and I'm really wanting to stick with that theme. I have been really trying to transition into that more neutral kind of cottage farmhouse look and so far I'm really loving how everything has come together. If you guys missed my bedroom makeover, I would really love for you guys to check that out. I absolutely love how that came together. It's so neutral and cozy and inviting now and I just love walking in there. So I'm trying to incorporate that into this area and make this also kind of a cozy, warm, inviting space to enjoy with the family and anybody that actually comes over here to enjoy it as well. So um, if you do like today's video, please make sure to comment, like, and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And also follow me on Instagram at Amber the Happy Homemaker as well to get late and updates of anything that I post. So with that being said, let's get started on decorating for spring in the living room. So as you can see, the chimney is very tall and you can see it from all angles, no matter where you enter the house. So I really want this to be the main focus point from anywhere that you enter. Um, and I wanted to give everything a good cleaning um, because after winter and running the pellet stove, we keep our fan going all the time in the winter just to move the heat around. Um, so things get very dusty up here. So I just wanted to give everything a good cleaning before we start decorating. I always like to start from the top and work my way down. On this side, I'm going to be doing the top left and working my way down and then I'll move over to the right and start working over there. So now that the shelves are done, I'm going to move over to the mantle and I always like to layer on the mantle just because of how tall this area is. Um, I just feel like it draws the eye up because it is such a tall area. So you'll see me doing a lot of that and playing around here.
So this is how the fireplace and the mantle, the built-ins turned out. I absolutely love it. It's very different than what I normally do, but I'm really excited to kind of look at this and get new ideas for the rest of the season um, and decorating. So, but now I'm just gonna move on to some other areas around the living room and touch those up for spring as well. So this is the living room as a whole. I'm very happy with how everything turned out, just very neutral and I'm just loving all of the spring kind of touches in here now to kind of carry on from the rest of the decorating that we've done in the house. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and as always, if you did, please make sure to comment, like, and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.